The Mad Titan is back, boys. Like, I am so excited for this shit. This guy is a fucking menace to society. Thanos issue one just came out this week, and we find out about this chick that I guess Thanos wants. And Illuminati is back as well with a new, fresh new team. And issue one and with the perfect cliffhanger. So start with this girl named Roberta Marshall right here. And practically she's watching a TV show about two lovebirds on Fiji and about how the guy doesn't like want to open up to a girl basically. This takes place in Fresno, California, by the way. And we just see Roberta going through like her motions of her life, like day in, day out, or nine to five job. One thing more about this story we're hearing about is death. Like death, death, dead, dead stuff. And I have a hunch who this person is. And we keep seeing background stuff about like death and cemetery. And eventually she goes to the cemetery for some reason and then decides to go home after that. While she's sleeping on her couch, she sees like this fucking black hole vortex and she goes, ah! But we see fucking Thanos' jaw. We see this big ass ship coming to earth. And while she's talking to this lady right here, she's like, wait, oh my, you're, you're my you're my daughter. And I believe this chick thinks that's her daughter, but it's not. And this fucking big ass ship is coming by to earth. I'm like, dude, this is fucking Thanos, bro. And Roberta's like, I remember Marshall. And then after that happens, we see fucking Thanos shoot this big ass laser at Fresno. And it's destroying the whole fucking city. Just putting like a big ass circle around it while Roberta's telling that chick she met, like, you need to get the fuck out of here and try to save as much people as she, as she can. She fucking takes the deck, right? And she tries to stay alive while everything outside of her city is just getting blown up to fucking pieces. And this is what Thanos did, bro. Make a big ass fucking circle and, and just pull it out into space. I'm like, holy fuck. And that's when I see Thanos in a fucking chair to start gliding to the city. I'm like, dude, this guy's a fucking menace. Thanos says, hear me, Fresno. There is one who I seek, but the rest are but chaff. There will be a Cohen until I find her. We see Roberto wake up after the whole situation, right? And we see the new Illuminati team, which is Tony, Emma Frost, Mr. Fantastic, Blue Marvel, and Doctor Strange, which I honestly like this lineup a lot. They're telling her that Thanos needs you. And we don't know why yet, but it's complicated. And she's like, I'm just a random person. Like, who the fuck does want me? And we see a big eyes laser going, Pshoo! and it's fucking Thanos. I am fucking, oh my gosh. I wish we got more Thanos, but Marvel does a wonderful job about um all this and i absolutely love it back to this chick again i have a feeling this is death um thanos's wife or whatever or someone that can revive her because the whole comic we keep seeing death death misery and she went to her graveyard and stuff and right when thanos came out of the black hole it seems like she was asleep and it seems like they're very connected let me know if you guys think about that theory